honored and humbled to receive such an award. Henry Scotty was a wonderful man. He was a uh, pioneer for the disabled. And uh, to be associated with Henry Riscotti is a thrill for me, an honor, and I'm humbled to receive this award. Well, it's an absolute thrill uh, to be recognized here. Uh, the Viscardi Center is a leader. Uh, Mr. Viscardi and his work throughout his life uh, was not only incredible, uh, but he's left this amazing legacy. And John Kemp is, uh, is a personal hero of mine. So, so it's a real honor to, to be here and to be a part of uh, a wonderful group of people. Uh, receiving this award tonight is, uh, is, is very important. Uh, I'm very excited to win this award. But the important thing is for me is that uh, winning an award of this caliber uh, shines the spotlight on the fact that people with disabilities are not being employed in large numbers. And it's one of the one of the issues that we have in North America is high unemployment rate for people with disabilities. And so winning an award of this caliber focuses and shines a spotlight on that issue and helps us to move the needle forward. Uh, it is truly an honor to be here, to be associated at all, in some degree, to, with uh, Dr. Henry Riscardi, his legacy, and to meet all the people in this room who are dedicating their lives to help people with disabilities, some sort of disability. So it's inspiring, it's an honor, and thank you. And it's a true honor and pleasure to be here tonight. Um, special thanks goes out to the Viscardi organization. As a wounded vet, I'm appreciative of Dr. Viscardi's early work at Walter Reed. And as a person with an amputation, I have benefited directly from his work. It's a true honor to be here. I'm, I'm humbled. It's, this board's really about all the people I serve. And, and I'm just a true honor to help them move back into life. And it's a true honor to take my experiences and reflect on those so we can help other people. It's really an honor when you get an award from, that recognizes the work that people do to improve the lives of people with disabilities. So I've been an advocate since, you know, most of my life. Uh, and it, it is really, the Scotty School and the Scotty Center have always been one of the places where people recognize their commitment and to people with disabilities at different stages in their lives. And that's really something that people don't want to have. So I, I'm, it's really a great honor. A beautiful night at Mutual America with the President's reception, board members, corporate partners, people with disabilities, leaders, students of our school. Just a fantastic night and just really wonderful to share our mission and also to receive the good wishes from all everyone. So, Happy New Year and Happy Holiday, everyone.